Welcome back. We won't know until June just how long the fired officer, the convicted felon, Derek Chauvin, will be in prison for murdering George Floyd. But we do know Judge Cahill's sentencing history. Our chief legal correspondent, Dr. Laura McNeil, explains. Now that the verdict is out that Derek Chauvin will be held guilty on all three counts for the murder of George Floyd, people are asking what's next? What's next for Derek Chauvin? How long will he be sentenced to? Well, those three charges carry some pretty heavy uh, potential sentencing guidelines. Uh, the second degree murder charge up to 40 years he can serve in prison. The third degree murder charge up to 25 years and then the second degree manslaughter charge up to 10 years in prison. What's important is Derek Chauvin decided to waive the right for the jury to decide other factors that might contribute to that decision of how many years he's actually going to serve in jail. Uh, some of the factors uh, that will be considered now by Judge Cahill, not the jury, will be things such as uh, were there any minors present when this murder happened? Well, we all saw the moving testimony of that precious little nine-year-old girl who was there just trying to buy candy at the cup food stores and she saw George Floyd begging to breathe, begging for his life. That's something Judge Cahill will take into account. Also, uh, the other minors that were present, how it impacted other people, uh, how egregious, how severe was the act, how malicious was the act. These are all things Judge Cahill's going to decide. Now, he's also going to consider the fact that Derek Chauvin has no prior criminal history. And so what they're estimating is that uh, he might be sentenced to about 12 and a half years. Now, what's important about that, it sounds low, uh, and it is low, but it's important to note that uh, Judge Cahill has a reputation uh, here in Minneapolis uh, for giving very tough sentences on the harsher side of the sentencing guidelines. And so he's known for being on the high end. And so that's something that we should take into consideration. Highly likely that Derek Chauvin will get more than 12 and a half years because the crime was so egregious because the crime uh, was something that we all saw and it was just no excuse for what we saw happen. Uh, that sentencing hearing will be set for a couple of weeks and we will know Derek Chauvin's fate. From Minneapolis, I'm Dr. Laura McNeil.